This thing is so capable of doing some crazy stuff, really just because of that differential thrust. But it works really well. So safe off, go up, and then just differential thrust over. Oh, there it is, there it is. Look at that. Got it? Safe on? Save me, please. There, yes. <laughs> I think I figured it out. Okay. That poor pilot. Crazy. Oh yeah, he's blowing chunks right now. <laughs> oh, look out. Here we go. Oh, we're good, we're good. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Off into the sunset. Mm -hmm, it's beautiful. This is so cool. So fun. Oh, so cool, so cool, so cool, so cool, so cool. Getting confident. Second flight. Abby, you're gonna like it. I got the pizza to buy for the whole subscribers watching. We have the new Ultrix 600. That this, wasn't cringy. Not cringy at all, but that's our channel. 280,000 people are okay with cringe. If you're not, that's okay. We're gonna have some cringe fun today with this really awesome, brand new, just announced today, Ultrix 600. I also know magic on the channel. I can have two airplanes and one. This is the <laughs> older from last year, UMX Ultrix. And actually, no one talks about this, probably just because it's so small, but it's one of the most fun, capable little airplanes that we have ever flown. And Abby and I love flying ours. We each have one. And now this larger one came out. I'll show you a size difference, but effectively it is almost the same airplane, just larger, a little more powerful. So I would expect a lot more fun. We're gonna maiden it in today's video. And I have to say, when putting it together, it was so difficult because it comes just like this. All you have to do- Note the sarcasm. Yeah. <laughs> pulled out of the box and just friction held in these little vertical stabilizers and now it's ready to go. Uh, you can also install an optional front wheel landing gear. Boom. And now we can take off and land on asphalt. At least maybe some really short grass. There are two wheels in the back. This actually binds up. I think it's E-Flight's very first UMX airplane. It binds like a UMX airplane is what I'm getting at. You plug in the battery, then you do the bind procedure. It's not your standard E-Flight binding procedure. It's extremely easy. Safe's already thrown onto a switch, the back left switch, A, I think it is. And it's recommended that this airplane will fly on an IC2, you know, the new cute little orange plug connector. There are converters that you can take from IC2 to IC3. It'll fly on a 3000 milliamp battery and a little bit larger than what I'm gonna fly on today, but it does recommend an 850 milliamp battery. And it just so happens that the UMX A10 and the Blade 230S will both fly on that battery. So I happen to have three of them. I'm going to fly on that battery today. I'm really, really excited. As I said, I love flying the little UMX version. There you go. Abby and I have actually flown the snot out of this little guy. This should be more powerful. It's two brushless motors. We'll have differential thrust, just like we do on this, and elevons, you know? These two little control surfaces work together. There are only two control surfaces, and I really cannot wait. We have safe assigned to a switch. Let's stop gabbing and fly. Fingers crossed, this thing is crazy. Um, yeah, I'm nervous. Oh, awesome. Why? <laughs> Were you nervous? I don't know. <laughs> I, just every maiden I get nervous. <laughs> so according to the instruction manual for sport flying, put the battery pretty far up in the nose for 3D flying. Extreme 3D extreme flying. Extreme 3D flying. Uh, don't put it far up in the nose. A little farther back is more. So I'm in safe, obviously. I just didn't know what to expect out of this. Um, even, it's just been a while since I've flown my Ultrix, actually. And uh, this is bigger than a Maiden, so I don't want to make it explode on the first flight. <laughs> it's nice and quiet, two brushless motors. And in this mode, you know, there's hands free at like 30% throttle. So it flies extremely well, very, very well. Let's go full throttle. Hand up. I'll just do a full throttle pass, and then I'm going to get out of safe pretty quickly. Oh, differential thrust in safe mode, that's cool. And full throttle, you ready? You get that? Mm-hmm. Nice. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go out of safe right up here. And can I do a loop? Oh yeah, do a loop just fine. Can I roll it? Of course. <laughs> Kick safe back on, I wanna get it closer. Now that I know it can fly out of safe, no problem, I'll get a little closer and a little lower. Abby, you were trying to direct me where to fly. No, I just had an itch on my head. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Penny. 
Man, that is sweet. This flies really good. Safe mode is just really nice. I like mixing in differential thrust so it'll turn a bit faster. Watch these rolls. And then safe. Boom. Saved me. Love this thing. Yeah. Well, the original Altrix is awesome. And now this one. Oh, no. I was pushing down and I shouldn't have done that. I was about watch to this. say, watch I'm going to fly watch this next. Watch next time you see this on the channel, I will fly. It's a pancake. Man. I'll try that again. I got to do that flat spin. You remember how we did that? Um, I never did it. Here, watch, well, wait. Watch, watch, no, maybe I did do that. I don't remember. This thing can do some crazy stuff. I just don't remember how to do it. Look at that. There, there, there. We're getting close. We're getting close. And then I go safe and boom. Yeah, but you were it. able to do it flat. I know. I know. It took some practice. I got to get there again. Do better. I'll do better. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's see. We went up, out of safe, and then I'd go like this. Almost, almost. And then safe to save it. Always. Oh, it's so awesome. So... Hmm, it's gonna take me a minute to get that back down. But this thing is so capable of doing some crazy stuff, really just because of that differential thrust. But it works really well. So safe off, go up, and then just differential thrust over. Oh, there it is, there it is. Look at that. Got it? Safe on, save me, please. There, yes. <laughs> I think I figured it out. Okay. That poor pilot. So oh yeah, he's blowing chunks right now. <laughs> And then, remember, it'll do like really nice harriers and stuff too. You can just kind of go vertical with it. They're safe off. And then, look at that. Look at that. Yes! <laughs> Throttle out of it. You ready to do it? Here you go. Ow! It's so easy! Flying pizza box! Woo woo woo! Safe on, and it saves you. Wow! I love this thing. Okay. Who wants to see more than one flight on this today? When, uh, when the battery gets low, we'll bring it in for another one here. Look at that, Abby. Isn't that sweet? Just yeah, a little hairier. I like that. The other Altrix, I could do this like two inches off the ground. Yeah, you should try. I might, but I'm also just afraid, you know, because it's a new airplane. Oh, knife edge. Oh, nice. Yes. <laughs> ah, that's cool. Watch. Knife edging with differential thrust. Oh, it's so, uh, it's a little sloppy, but watch. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. Ah, don't crash. Okay, now <laughs> I go up, and then we're gonna go pizza box mode in the tornado. You gotta tell people how you're doing that. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Uh, you really have to do almost nothing. So I'm in safe mode, and then I kick safe off. I go up, full throttle, and then I just go full throttle with a direction. That's it. That's it. Just one stick up in the corner. Throw safe. <laughs> So when you're climbing, that's, and there's a better way to do this too, but that, that does get the job done. Okay, we're gonna go safe off and then just try to like harrier it in a little bit. That was my fault. It'd harrier better if I had the battery a little farther back, but isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. Look at that. Oh, that's so awesome. This thing is so sweet. If you like the Altrix, you obviously have to get one of these. If you've never flown, the Ultrix, I highly recommend it. And if you just want something a little bit bigger, a little bit more powerful, I am like 10% throttle right now. Just cruising here, safe off, nose up. Low alpha maneuver, that's what that would be called, right? Low alpha, not high alpha. You're asking the wrong person. <laughs> I'm using differential thrust and ailerons to help me turn like that. And then just, I could get a bit lower, just not ready yet. This first battery, first battery. Oh man, this is fun. The bird even likes me. Look at that. What do you think? I love this plane. Me too. I was excited when you told me they came out with me a bigger too. version. I'm kind of jealous that you get to fly it first, but that's you, okay. I'll you fly, fly it, it in next. This video or do you no, want to... I'll fly it in my own video. Thank you very okay, much. Okay. <laughs> Look, let's see if I can do this lower. Keep okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, I didn't even touch. <laughs> yeah, this thing is sweet. I'm feeling more comfortable now. Let's see. Okay, let's go vertical. And then we're going to do our crazy spin. And then we might just put a new battery in just for the sake of it. I'm trying to give a little <laughs> bit of elevator too. Let's land it. I'll, uh, hmm. Should I land in safe or safe off? Up to you. I'll do safe off. We'll land it. We'll put a fresh pack in. And, uh, oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. Apparently landed in safe. <laughs> no, I just need a little bit of. There we go. I'll Very take that. Nice. Taxi's nice because of the differential thrust. That's that's the only reason I. Oh, stupid! <laughs> <call that. laughs> 
The only reason I can steer it is because of the di differential thrust. It is not a steerable wheel. <laughs> it is just one motor. The wheels turn. are <laughs> taking oh, yeah. out. Isn't that cool? It's hilarious. Wow. Let's do a new battery. I'm going to recommend you Velcro the snot out of your plane. It flew really good on this CG. I'm showing you guys the back of the battery is flush with the front of the battery tray lip. You see that? Mm -hmm. so the back of my battery is flush with that. Now, if I go forward more, it'll fly more sporty. So less of this and more of this. I think I'm going to put my battery back just a quarter of an inch or so further because I really like that, you know, tail heavy kind of stuff. So let's do it again. No safe. I'm going to try just completely safe off. And when I take off, I'm going to plan on going straight up, like almost straight up. Okay. okay. And then pizza box mode. Nope, didn't work that time. <laughs> I don't know why. I think I had a little bit of my right stick mixed in with it. So if I didn't say that, nobody would have known. Watch the rolls. And can I, yes, I did it without kicking safe. Oh, this thing is fun. Snap roll kind of thing. This thing there, is. Look, 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 look. Oh, I almost had it flat. Wow. Safe on. Just that was looking it. wild. What do you guys think? Super cool, right? Super cool. No trimming needed in safe mode or, or not in safe mode. This thing is just perfect out of the box. You know, I've always wondered why they don't do slightly larger UMX planes. I know they're not calling this a UMX plane. The original was. This is after, actually E-Flight's name behind it. But in my well, opinion- Well, e, it was E-Flight UMX, just uh, I to know be that. clear. I know, but now UMX was dropped just for this larger version. And um, it just binds up like a UMX. So it just makes me feel all UMX-y, you know? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's the off. And then put that nose up a little bit, just a touch of throttle, a little bit more elevator, play with the throttle a little bit, use differential Wait. thrust to steer you around. Still. What do you think about this airplane? I love it. It makes me kind of like concentrate and practice doing a few different things. Because, you know, we still have AS3X working in our benefit right now. Man, this is cool. I like the bigger version more than the smaller version. Although I can fly that small version like really 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 tight spaces like this but i feel like i could get it even even tighter oh look out here we go oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> oh my gosh off into the sunset mm -hmm, it's beautiful this is so cool so fun oh so cool so cool so cool so cool so cool getting confident second flight abby you're gonna like it <laughs> makes me want to get the umx ultrix back out just to fly around with you some more play around do this stuff. This is what's fun to me. Fly it super low and slow. Look at that, there we go. That's what I was talking about. Can I get those wheels down? Oh, did, and then back up. And then what we can do is nice quick little roll and then go up, full throttle, and do the pizza box mode. There it is, that was so nice. There, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Safe switch. Thank you. Can you imagine being in that, that pilot? You know. <laughs> like, just thinking about it makes me want to hurl. <laughs> then you can go like this, and then uh, knife edges a little bit just because of that differential thrust. Oh, man, this is fun. <laughs> Look at that. Woo, I'm upside down. <laughs> Safe switch gets it every time. That's a true testament to how well safe works. There, safe's back off. But you guys, like it's going absolutely nuts. And then you throw safe and it just saves it. Oops, wrong way. <laughs> okay, there we go. And we'll do it one more time because it's so awesome. There we go. It's going crazy, 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 crazy. And safe switch. And it just knocks it right i want to see you recover from it <laughs> oh really on this flight okay let's i see challenge it. you all right good challenge okay can safe they song. actually whoa whoa, whoa. okay ready, ready, ready? can they actually recover from let's this try it. here we go a couple mistakes hi i'd say we're into it right right okay there i just i just let go of it and, and it just kind of stopped out. doing it <laughs> yeah okay that doesn't well, seem fair it's not doing a whole lot there <laughs> but it is saving it Wow, this is fun. Abby, you're gonna love flying this thing. What am I hearing? I don't know, this bird sound. It sounded like a whistle. It did. Here, 
Well, that's awesome, Nate. Yeah, I guess I'll bring it in for a landing, okay? Mm-hmm. I'm going to land it out of safe. Those birds sound crazy. And maybe that's the plane. It's just quiet up here. Okay, here we go. Let's bring it in for a nice smooth landing. Try to, anyway. Get it down here as close as I can. Get ready to pull up. Get those back wheels down. Oh, wow, it's a three-point landing if I ever saw one. Wow. <laughs> and then remember, you can steer it. You just have to have throttle on <laughs> to steer it. Wow, that was fun. Nice. That is what I like in an RC plane. Hobby grade, works right out of the box. There's no frustrating build at all. Literally, to put it back in the box and to put it together, you just press fit these vertical stabilizers on and you can hand launch this, but if you have the option to take off from, you need very little space and maybe low grass, but very little space to take off and land as you guys saw. This is just super fun. You can fly it in safe mode or out of safe mode like a normal airplane. All the control surfaces do the same, you know, like the sticks. So throttle, still throttle, the right stick is still bank and yank to turn, but then you can get a little fancy when you use so it's rudder. a three channel plane, yeah? Well. It's four, because when you use rudder, instead of having a vertical fin back here that does this, your motor, one will spin faster than the other. And this all works right out of the box. There's no confusing programming to do. You just hold that bind button, boop, and it binds up and everything works the way it's supposed to. It took me longer to name the airplane in my radio than it did to build it and bind it. And I am excited about that because that doesn't happen very often. I really like that it's got these two wheels on the back, the wheel on the front, so you can do asphalt, kind of taxiing, taking off landing, can get down and try to touch those two wheels as you're coming in with a little high alpha out of safe mode. There's a lot of progression to be had here. There's a lot of showy offy maneuvers you can do that are really very easy to do actually. Just push that throttle stick up and then pick a direction and it'll go absolutely nuts spinning in the air. Throw that safe switch. No one has to know you threw that safe switch and then boom, it'll fly off again, off into the sunset. You're a professional and you really didn't do anything. <laughs> that I like. Batteries are smart and they're cheap. I mean, who could complain about that? I love these new little IC2 connectors. They're better than XT. 30, they're better than XT60. These IC plugs are better than the EC plugs. They're the best plugs on the market. Honestly, for this kind of airplane, it is mind blown because it's just doing what it's supposed to do. No faults, no expensive break in the wallet. This needs to be in your collection. Super fun, super sporty, stunty, but also very calm if you want to. Like I said, you can fly it in safe mode like a trainer thing if you really wanted to, but then you can slow it down and get it nice and kind of like ballerina. You know, what are these called, Abby? Pirouettes? Huh? Yeah. Uh, close to the you ground. It. And it's not that hard to do. And if you panic, throw that safe switch and it's going to be a very durable airplane too. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, if you want to be all fun and excited like us, we'll have a link in the description box below. It's available for pre-order right now if you're amazing and watching this video the first day we released it because you're a subscriber. But if you're watching this months after it's come out, still using that link will help support our channel and our family. And if morals that are similar to ours mean something to you and you want to help support us, and just be one of those few rare family-friendly channels on YouTube, on the internet. You wanna help us out, use that link and order one of these. We'll also link the battery we flew on, the radio that I flew on, the charger we use, even the little converter that you'll need to charge those little batteries. It'll all be linked below, and I promise it'll be one of the easiest things you ever got in the air. Absolutely awesome. For a successful maiden, a beautiful day, a nice calm day to fly, I thank God. Also, a massive thanks to our Patreon supporters because you guys, are just the bee's knees. We love you. Thank you very much for supporting what we do. You mean the world to us. You really do. And I hope that just saying that in every video lets you know how much you mean to us. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. We love our original UMX Ultrix so much. We'll have one of those videos popping up right about now. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there. Bye.